All right, question two. So, kulumanga ma number patterns, and it's a combination of a quadratic and the arithmetic sequence. In the description box, so tola ma links for other recordings in Wayne Zilo for the question paper. So, yeah, thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching. As pendule now on question two. So, 2.1. Given the quadratic sequence 2, 3, 10, and 23, all the way up to infinity, going all the way up to infinity. Well, 2.1.1, but to write down the next term of the sequence. This is the given sequence. So, in Togomelu Yenzele, now Bufuna the next term, especially now we end term out now. Bufuna the next term, this is what you do. Um, since it's a quadratic sequence, Sine second common difference so for the first common difference 3 minus 2 that's 1 10 minus 3 that's 7 23 minus 10 that's 13 so it's 1 7 and 13 and then we have a common difference of 6 right so in order to find the the, the following term comeling tatelo 6 in sanganisi no 13 in sanganisi no 23 so as in Jalo, what is six plus thirteen plus twenty-three is equal to forty-two. So our next term la now bani forty-two. Two point one point two. Two point one point two. See for now the end term of the sequence. Lena a quadratic sequence. A quadratic sequence if it's seven inside the first branch this branch for finding our n term if form, I'm a formulas way to as what 2a equal 2a equal to 6 now I'm going to calculate to a using the first branch in seven inside the formulated 2a equal to 6 the common difference a is equal to 3 la, if you divide up both sides by 2 and then up being in taller using this formula like 3 a plus b equal to 1 we substitute to 3 way to lagu a and then 3 times 3 that's 9 and i'm transpose all 9 in total to b is equal to 1 minus 9 b is equal to minus 8. for c you know, seven to a plus b plus c equal to 2. We substitute to a no b 3 minus 8 that's negative 5. Transpose to negative 5, you figure out level positive 5. 2 plus 5 is equal to 7. So C is equal to 7. The n term is equal to Tn equal to 3n squared minus 8n plus 7. And so see as with the n term or the general formula for a quadratic equation is this. A n squared plus b n plus c we just need to calculate to a or b you see right now n term here to now for 2.1.3 but this taller the 20th term of the sequence there's nothing difficult in the question there especially this whole question two the interesting part for me now 2.3 which is is always is a figure but for now as a substitute, so for now the 20th term, the 20th term of T20 the sequence here to load T1, T2, T3, T4, T20 to somewhere we for no calculator here. So we touch the n term where there's n in Fagubani 20. So it's 3 times 20 squared minus 8 times 20 plus 7. This is equal to 10 for the 7 is equal to 10 for the 7. 2.2. We are given the arithmetic sequence here this time 3, 35, 28, 21. Calculate which term of the sequence will have a value of minus 140. So, in other words, it's for the value for n. Somewhere along the sequence, there's a term minus 140 low 1 low 2 low 3 we don't know what you minus 140 or term number one we want to calculate the end I, I mean the the end value for this term so therefore i just substitute into this equation a in now 35 
D is the common difference. With Tn is minus 1 fourth. I need to calculate the value ga A ga N. So as to the common difference, what is 28 minus 35? It's minus 7. So my common difference is minus 7. So D is negative 7. Let us substitute again. Minus 140, it's equal to 35 plus N minus 1 in bracket minus 7 then we solve for this bracket so negative 7 times n negative 7 times minus 1 answer a 2 answer a 2 now answer a 2 it's minus 40 equal to 35 minus 7 n plus 7 right and then if we going to n the subject of the formula la. If we going to isolate to n so as telling we get all my like terms on the right hand side in 1242 transpose a 140 to the right and then u 7n to the left you figure my level positive 7n equal to 42 plus 140 what is 42 plus 140 that's 182 182 182 so divide both sides by 7 is equal to 26 so n1 or 26 so it means u term minus 140 u term 26 of the sequence now as you go 2.3 i think eraser all right now go 2.3 this is going to be an interesting one um, for which value of n will the sum of the first n terms of the arithmetic sequence in question 2.2 be equal to the n term of the quadratic sequence right so I mean which value of n is or ends the quadratic n term is equal to the sum of n terms of the arithmetic sequence. I have the n term for the quadratic pattern. Check. Now I need the sum of the first n terms of the arithmetic sequence. So I'm scaling a log 2.3. Sum of n terms for the arithmetic sequence can be expressed using this formula or the other one sn equal to n over 2 in bracket to a plus the last term right my seven is an alley but mean i'm going to stick to this one right so the sum of n terms for this arithmetic sequence like 2.2 see a substitute a 35 d the common difference now negative Seven. So if we simplify it, now seventy. Then it's negative seven n plus seven n. Seven plus seventy. It's seventy seven n over two. Now we have negative seven n. Now right. So therefore, remember one quarter. The n term for the quadratic pattern nine. Then we equate the two. We equate the two. The first n terms of an arithmetic sequence will be equal to the n term of the quadratic sequence. So therefore, therefore, Tn 3n squared minus 8n plus 7 is equal to n over 2, 77 minus 7n. Right? So it's going to calculate the value for n in this equation. So learning the fraction, as you remove this fraction, it's before we, before we can solve for the bracket. So you multiply throughout by two, on the on the right you multiply by two, and then on the on the left hand side you multiply by two as well. So so like so about six n squared, learn go be minus sixteen n, learn go be positive fourteen. And then we will n 77 minus 7 n and then so like 6 n squared minus 16 n plus 14 equal to 77 n minus 7 n 
squared. Here we go. Then it's in a quadratic equation. Move everything to the left. So n squared la, minus 16n plus 14 minus 77 n plus 7 n squared this is equal to zero is equal to zero so what is okay we have about 13 la. yeah about 13 n squared this one and this one it's negative 16 minus 77 this is equal to negative 93 negative 93 n plus 14 plus 14 is equal to 0 is equal to 0 hmm okay all right all right all right all right uh, so this one okay lana 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 funny quadratic formula la. but minang sevensa the factoring method again it's not that of a bigger number with the uncle see 13 13 uh, what is 13 times 14 what is 13 times 14 2 okay 13 times 14 13 times 14 no 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 so 13 times 7 91 plus 2 okay so lana go 7 negative no negative bunny 2 so my answers are n equal to 7 n equal to 7 so now I answer I'm n equal to 7 the n value must be a whole number this root is about n equal to 2 over 13 then I equal applicable over the n term is always a positive rational number it's always a positive rational number so question two Pelelalana, guys. I hope we enjoy it. I hope we will get some value out of this video. Um, so for now, as one I know, the next one, unga kothluk share, unga kothluk like, unga kothluk subscribe. Now, if you have a question, ask me in the comment section, description box. Kuna manya ma video nga wabugela. For now, peace.